Jawbone is one of those great examples of how working with Lee things would evolve in a show and how you would get excited about a concept or an idea and come up with different ideas and how it would grow. So the skeleton corset was already on way and been made and we, I had carved the vertebrae and the ribs and things were being cast. But then as I looked more and more into researching bones and finding resins of bones like medical skeletons, I then came across a jawbone and just playing with it and looking at it and studying it, I actually put it up against my face and it looked really powerful on the outside. So I then approached Lee and said, if we've got the skeleton corset on the girls, why don't we put the jaw bones on the guys? He loved the idea and then that's how it began. So then we went back to drawing board and we carved jaw bones in wax. We did two versions actually, a female and a male. So if you look closely, some of them are more broader and heavier than some of the more finer. Cast them in aluminium and then I made two fittings like a reverse of the glasses to clip around the back of the ear because again with my work with Lee it was all about optical illusion. I wanted the jawbone to look as if it was part of the model 